If you're looking for the best outdoor wood sealer here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the 10th position of our list, we have Seal Once Exotic Sealer. This is a water-based wood sealer from Seal Once, and there are several good things about that. First of all, you won't really have to worry about choking your guts out from the fumes, as this product is pretty mild. You wouldn't want to go sticking your nose in the can, but its odors aren't that bad at all. This product is specifically formulated for use on hardwoods, especially tropical hardwoods like teak and mahogany. These woods are so expensive that you would be crazy to leave them uncoated. If your target object is made of oak or walnut, you should see excellent results as well. There is no self-leveling feature with this product, and I can tell the difference. It's not a huge difference, but it is a little harder to avoid putting brush strokes in the final finish. Obviously, these strokes will have to be buffed out, which is a pain, so be a little more careful when you use this sealer. I should also mention that this product isn't the best choice for softwoods. It is made for harder woods and may raise the grain of softer woods. By the time it dries, the wood has had time to absorb a lot of water, locking it inside forever as the sealant dries. Moving on to the next at number 9 with Eco Procoat Acrisoy Penetrating Sealer. This one is very different from the other sealers on my list, as it is made from soybean oil. This natural formulation makes the product a lot less toxic and a lot less stinky. You probably won't even have to worry about a dust mask when using this stuff. For such a specialized product, its price is actually quite low. This product has two main selling points. For one, it's a lot better for the environment than most other options. For another, it is said to last a lot longer. In fact, the advertising says that the finish will probably outlive you. I am skeptical of this claim, as only time will tell if it is true. The biggest problem here is the factor of time efficiency. This product takes days to fully dry, and some say that it can take weeks. Some of this will probably depend on your method of application, but that's still a long delay. On top of that, this sealer has a thin consistency, so you'll probably need multiple coats. The number 8 position is held by Deckwise Ipe Seal Hardwood End Grain Sealer. This is a very specialized type of sealer, making it different from our other choices. This one is specifically designed to prevent cracking at the ends. When a piece of wood begins to split, it always starts at the end, so this product can be used to stop a problem in its infancy. Whether used as an end sealer or a general purpose sealer, this product seems to do its job very effectively. One of the most impressive things about this product is the fact that it gets about 500 square feet of coverage from a quart-sized can. This makes the product an even better bargain. This one takes a full 48 hours to dry, so it's not the one to choose when you're in a hurry. Being wax-based, it has some slightly different properties, which could make it problematic for beginners. However, I can't help but notice that this product offers no guarantee of effectiveness. Next at number 7 we have Seal Once Nano Plus Poly Penetrating Wood Sealer. This is a premium wood sealer which means that its maker has put a little more effort into its quality. Of course, it also makes for a higher price, but that's perfectly normal. This product earns its asking price by providing a longer lifespan than most other sealers. While most sealers will need to be reapplied every 1 to 3 years, this one is supposed to last 6 to 10 years. That's quite impressive, but we aren't sure if this product has been around long enough to prove such a claim. The manufacturer promises 10 years for vertical surfaces and 6 years for horizontal ones. This product will be too expensive for some people, but that's the price of high quality. Still, I can find a few failings with this stuff. According to both the company and many customers, this sealer will allow the wood to turn gray over time. While this is natural, it can result in an ugly deck. Thus, you need to add some kind of tint to this sealant unless you like the look of grade wood. 
Some people have also reported storage problems, saying that the product would separate into two layers after sitting in the can for a while. However, I'm suspicious of these claims, because such a problem could easily be solved by shaking the can. The number 6 position is held by Anchor Seal 2 Greenwood Sealer. Anchor Seal Sealer has been used by professionals for decades. It is most widely known to protect wood against end grain checking. End grain checking is the term given to the splinters that you see at the end of wood planks that most often happens right after the wood is cut. Keep in mind that as long as your piece of wood has some kind of end grain on it you can use this sealer. I've been using this sealer on all of my green wood blanks for about a year now, and I definitely like it. Anchor seal does reduce cracking by quite a bit, the sealer really cuts down on checking, it actually decreases cracking by 90%. The quality is really good and it's totally worth it. Anchor seal is the top choice for most contractors when it comes to fixing and grain checking, after applying two to three coats, you will likely never have to worry about the splintering of that piece of wood again. It is most effective when applied right after the cut is made into the wood hence the name green wood sealer. To put it as simply as possible, it is just a mixture of water and wax. As the sealer dries the water evaporates leaving a nice solid wax film over the end grain. It's very simple to apply, just take the sealer and brush it to the end grain. This product is almost wax-like when dried, so it is not made for sealing all kinds of projects. For example, you'd apply it to the end of the wood on your newly constructed deck, but you wouldn't use it to stain the entire thing. The number 5 position is dominated by Waterlock's original marine sealer. This is the only marine sealer on the list, which means that it will probably offer superior protection against water. If you don't know what we mean, marine paints are suitable for watercraft. Thus, they are held to a much higher standard in the area of waterproofing. Some marine paints are meant to be used above the waterline only, but this one seems to be fine for general marine use. This sealer is made from a natural substance called tongue oil. Tongue oil was first used in ancient China and is obtained from the nut of the tongue tree. This substance falls under the category of a drying oil, meaning that it will dry to a hard finish, most oils do not do this. Tongue oil provides a rich shine that is second to none in terms of beauty. Thus, for jobs in which appearance is paramount, this is a fine choice indeed. Like many other marine paints, this one does not dry to a perfectly smooth finish. Its texture when dry is a little bit rough and lumpy. Because of this, it might not be the best choice for your deck. You will have to use a buffer or some similar tool if you want a smooth finish. Because of this extra work, you should not get this product unless you live in a particularly wet slash humid area. This one is also a little bit expensive. It comes in a quart can, but it's actually more expensive than some of our gallon size options. Because it is handmade with natural materials, we should probably expect a higher price. Still, not everyone can afford that kind of money for a sealer. Moving on to the next at number 4 with Defy Crystal Clear Composite Deck Waterproofing Sealer. This product offers a few distinct advantages that are worth examining. First of all, the whole thing is water-based. That means you don't have to worry about toxic fumes, toxic runoff, or any other environmental concerns. Water-based compositions like this one are also much easier to clean up when you are finished. The advertising for this product makes a big deal about the fact that it includes zinc. Zinc is a metal that is often used for coating steel, but it also has some useful chemical properties. It helps the deck to resist both UV damage and mold slash mildew. The sun's UV rays can have a harsh and degrading effect on your deck finish, and mold and mildew are also a major problem. By keeping out more of the sunlight, this product creates an environment where mold and mildew cannot grow. Perhaps the biggest selling point of this item is its increased longevity. This product will normally last a year or two longer than most other products, and this is mainly due to its large amounts of protective ingredients. The manufacturers claim that they chose only the highest quality resins for this product, and I think they are probably honest about that. I can see a few problems with this product as well. For one thing, a lot of reviewers have claimed that this product doesn't work. 
I found several negative reviews that mentioned this problem, saying that they could not tell any difference after using the product. Because most users did not report this problem, I have to conclude that this product requires multiple coats in order to be effective. That's a little bit of a problem because this is one of the more expensive products on the list. When you are forced to use multiple coats, the price per job becomes even more. Also, this sealer doesn't leave the same kind of super shiny finish that we see from some others, but some users may like that. The number 3 position is held by AgriLife Trichopolymer Lumber Seal. Here we have a sealer that focuses a lot of its attention on environmental concerns. They have made it about as safe and non-toxic as a product of this sort can ever be. While all sealers will provide a waterproof surface, this product takes it to another level. It is rated for flood resistance, which means that it can be left underwater for long periods without ruination. I find this pretty impressive, and we wonder why this feature isn't seen more often. Apart from the relatively high cost of this sealer, I can see one consistent complaint. At least three reviewers have complained that this product does not cure properly and remains tacky and sticky. Most have not reported these problems, however, which leads us to believe that this finish will have trouble hardening under some conditions. Next at number 2 we have Thompson's Water Seal VOC Wood Protector. As this is one of the cheapest sealers on my list, it gets a few points right off the bat. For those with large projects to do, this sealer offers a chance to save a few bucks. Most buyers seem to agree that it delivers everything they need in a good sealer. Several people commented on the thick consistency of this sealer. Although this makes it impossible to use in a sprayer, the thick consistency has a couple of advantages. First of all, you are unlikely to need more than one coat. Second of all, it's very easy to apply the product to the wood. Watery products tend to run and leak a little bit. Based on a quick look at this product's material safety data sheet, MSDS, it may not be quite as safe and non-toxic as advertised. Some of these chemicals are a little concerning, even if this product is less harsh than most. Some people have also complained of an oily, grimy scum being left behind after the product dries. Many of those same people said this scum was hard to remove without damaging the finish. Finally the number one position is dominated by RainGuard Concentrate Premium Wood Sealer. This is a sealer that focuses on one thing, and that one thing is rain resistance. It seems to do a good job in this department, causing water to bead on the surface of a deck after almost a year. This is even more impressive when you consider the fact that it's one of the cheapest items on the list. Not only does this stuff keep the rain out, but it also contains ingredients that resist mold and mildew. Those are two of the worst enemies of outdoor wood, so that's always a handy thing. Even though this article is focused on wood, I am glad to see that this product works on other surfaces as well. As the icing on the cake, I might mention that this product is eco-friendly and comes with a 10-year guarantee. Although there are a few conditions to this offer, it shows a high degree of confidence on the part of the manufacturer. That's all for today. We upload product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button for the upcoming video notification.